Okay, now I'm going to be showing you the triangle inequality. What this means is that there are certain triangles that you just can't make. You just saw in the worksheet that you tried to create a 5, 9, 2 triangle. So what I've started is I used the compass to draw the 9 centimeter segment. Here's our 9 centimeter segment. And then I did my arc for 5 centimeters here. And I did my arc for 2 centimeters here. So right here, if I drew a line to the end point to somewhere in the circle, this would be a 2 centimeter line. I can show you right here. 2 centimeters is right there. So what we see here is there's no intersection between these arcs. Even if I drew my segment much closer to try to reach a little bit further, this 5 centimeter segment is still not going to be able to touch over here. Even if they laid flat against, they would still never touch. So there's no possible way to make a triangle with 5, 9, and 2 centimeter lengths. It does not work. Now, there is some math you can do to not have to try and draw this out every time. If you take the two smaller numbers and add them up, you get 7, which does not make 9. This sum of the two smaller sides of the triangle has to be bigger than the third side in order for it to work. So if that's less than the third side, it's not going to work. Let's try a different example. What if we did a triangle that was 3 centimeters and... 4 centimeters, that would be 7 centimeters. Now, in order for this triangle to work, I need to pick a third side besides 3 and 4 that would be less than this. How about 6? That means that if I add 3 and 4, it's 7, which is more than 6. Let's see if this triangle works. So I'm going to start by drawing the longest side as my base, 6 centimeters. Okay. And now I'm going to set my compass to 3 for one of the sides. So if I draw it at 3 here on the end point, draw my arc. Now I set it to 4 for the third side. You do not have to start with the smallest, with the largest side as your base, but it's helpful. Okay, anchor that down. Draw my arc. And look at that, they cross. So I'm able to draw a 3, 4, 6 triangle just fine. So in the next couple exercises, you are going to try to see whether or not a triangle can be made with different side lengths. Remember, the shortcut is to add up the two shorter lengths and see if they're longer than the third one. Let's do an example together. What if the side lengths were 5, 10, and 12? Would this triangle work? So we add up the two shorter lengths, which are 5 and 10, and we get 15. Is that more than 12? Yes, it is, so this triangle will work. How about 2, 2, and 2? What about an equilateral triangle with two sides, with um, sides that are 2 centimeters long? Will this work? If we add up two of the shorter sides, which is just any two sides, we get 4. Is that greater than the third side? Yes, it is. It's greater than that one. So an equilateral triangle will work. So. Go ahead and try these next few examples and see how you do with them.